when Roosevelt was inaugurated in March of 1933, there were machine gun nests at the corners of the great federal buildings in Washington for the first time since the Civil War, and the unemployment rates conceded that it was between 25 and 33 percent, and there was no direct relief for them, nothing. So it was a desperate situation. So Roosevelt shortened the work week, stimulated the economy, and attempted to generate a little bit of inflation. So he partly demonetized gold, but he set up these vast workfare programs. He was not going to pay people to be idle unless they were incapable of work. I mean, he helped people who were disabled, of course, but, but an able-bodied person who could work, uh, he would pay them to work. They might be out seeding trees in a forest or build an airport or a highway or something. He wanted them to do useful work and have the satisfaction of working, getting paid to work, and endowing the country with what today would be called infrastructure at a bargain price. And it was a brilliant program all in all.